Right guys, so one thing I do every day is try and write in my notebook. And basically every morning I write out like my goals and a couple of other little things just to help kind of keep me, keep my head in the game all the time. And so it varies day to day, but basically my goals stay the same. Uh, for extended periods of time until I either get very very close to achieving them or until I hit those targets and then I usually just set something the next stage forward. Guys, you're going to change all the time, that's okay. But what you will find is that over the course of you writing them down for weeks or months or years on end, stuff will keep turning up, keep showing up. It's those things you'll realize are actually what are important to you. They're the things that you really want to achieve. And then as long as you're continually focusing but on progressing on those goals, like you're doing the actions that it takes to actually achieve those goals and see those goals through, then that's how you'll achieve stuff in your life. And it won't just be a case of getting things done, but it'll be getting the things done that you actually want to do. Not just doing stuff for other people. And once you figure that out, once you actually get there, then you're not only gonna be doing stuff that you want to do, but you're gonna be achieving things that you want to achieve. You're gonna be working towards the things that are actually important to you. And that is why I write my goals down every morning. Now, Danny's actually kicked me out of the office today because she has a meeting this morning. So I'm working out in our dining table. So today what I need to do essentially is figure out everything that goes on in the week because I've got like my personal training business, I have the Stoic Pool cryptocurrency thing going, um, and I also have this site, I have various projects going on for each of them. I need to just figure out everything that I need to do in a week so that I can schedule it, so that I can have certain stuff on certain days and I can actually just focus on what I want. And this is just so that I can stay organized and I'm not wasting time doing stuff that I shouldn't be doing or like getting distracted by other things. I know what I've got to do, I know what the day is. And that's one of the things I've really been struggling on with since being on lockdown. I've just been flying by the seat of my pants, like just doing whatever I need to do on any day, like, blah, 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 like a high stress state all the time, trying to just rush through stuff. But what I need to do is just figure everything out and then work from there. Right, I'm gonna back in now. So, back in the office. Gotta be quiet, because Danny sat right there working. So what I've done is I basically made a list of everything here that I need to do. I basically got a list of everything that I need to do or everything that needs to be done on any given week. Organized it into the different like buckets. So I've got more than lifting, I've got stoic, and I've got just my personal stuff. And so what I'm gonna do now is organize when they need to be done. So put them in like a time that everything needs to be done. And then I'm gonna put it on the calendar and set alerts for myself so that I'm actually like, actually know what I've got to do, what days they gotta be done and when the deadlines are for them. One thing I've really been struggling to do is manage deadlines because really they're all artificial. And that's the thing that you kind of struggle with when you're working for yourself. And so just having these deadlines on the calendar gives me like another level of enforcing those deadlines so that I can actually stay on track and not just get distracted by things, which is something that I really struggle with. Right guys, so I've got everything laid out on this lovely colorful table. <laughs> and what I'm gonna do now is basically put this into my calendar and put it into the, 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 and this app right here. 
I'm going to do a different video in the future on how Habitica works, but just a heads up, it, that's the, what the app's called. If you're interested in getting that, I highly recommend it as a just a to-do list and to stay organized. Um, it's kind of a bit of a Tamagotchi style roleplay kind of thing as well, which just makes it a bit more fun and interesting, doesn't it, Danny? Yeah. <laughs> See? <laughs> right. So now that's done, get that sorted and then on with the rest of the day. Right then guys, so now that I've kind of got everything organized, it's really just a case of getting on with the work. So I'm gonna crack on, I'll catch up with you soon.